Well, howdy folks. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Whistle Wednesdays. Now we're gonna be taking a look at another Acme whistle today. This one right here, probably the most famous Acme whistle, probably one of the most famous whistles in the entire world. But first, last week I took a look at this one and I said this was the Acme taxi whistle. I was actually wrong. This is a 144 and it's called the Acme hockey whistle. The Acme 143 is called the taxi whistle and they look almost identical. The 144 is just slightly longer than the 143. We're gonna be taking a look at this one today. This is the Metropolitan or the Acme Model 15. And you can see right here on the box, it says authentic British police whistle. So if I turn the box here, you can see there's kind of a depiction of it. But um, this actually dates back over 150 years to the London Police Department. So if you go back 150, 160 years, um, the London cops, the Bobbies, they carried this little box that had like a handle on the side and they would kind of spin it and it would make a sound. And that was sort of the police sound. So, you know, if the police were coming, they could do that to let people know they were coming to get out of the way or whatever, or also to signal other police in the area that they were already on the scene. Cause keep in mind, this is way before walkie talkies. Well, those things were inefficient. They were big, they were heavy. Um, they got dropped, lost, broke, things like that. So they asked the Acme company to come up with a better solution. They came up with the Metropolitan Whistle. And all Bobbies have carried this ever since. So for the past um, 160 years or something, they have carried this Acme Model 15 Whistle. Now they make these in various colors. Um, the default one is nickel. They also make brass, rose gold, uh, gold plated. There's actually a sterling silver one. It's very expensive, uh, et cetera. But this particular one, is what they call the vintage because it's made to look like it's aged. So let's take a quick look here. There we go, this is the whistle. So again, this whistle shape, very iconic. Um, and of course it's sound is iconic as well. I feel like I should have the hat and the stick now, right? Anyway, this is a very iconic whistle, very iconic sound. And man, this thing is beautiful. I actually really like this vintage finish because it does look like it's been, you know, carried and and it's been in somebody's pocket and everything else. It's kind of got these uh, sort of discolorations and uh, sort of stains on it, which really looks cool. But anyway, they do make these in several different finishes. Uh, if you are curious and you want to own the whistle that the London Police has used for Good golly, who knows how long. So thanks for tuning in to Whistle Wednesdays. Make sure you check out that playlist link in the description. I've got quite a few of these videos now and I think I have uh, taken a look at four different Acme whistles over the series, but I'm sure there's a lot more to come because Acme makes dozens and dozens of whistles. Some really, really cool ones and really iconic ones, but I don't think any of them are more iconic than the Model 15.